Good afternoon and thank you for coming. Uh, this is a question kind of for the full group. Uh, Gundam was an epic that spawned a great deal of time and changed like locations. The way Miss was traveling and Shara was always chasing after them. Is there any particular location or event or character you all or scene you all remember distinctly that kind of really defined the experience for you? これは、えー、皆さん全員への質問ですが、えー、ガンダムの作品というのは場面場面がどんどん変わっていき、えー、旅をしてでそ,れ、えー、その中でシャアに追いかけられたりとかそういったシーンがどんどん続くわけですが皆さんお一人お一人の中で特にこの場所が好きこのキャラクターが好きそういったものはございますか Who do you want to answer start from? They're, they're, they're choice. They're amazing. I'll, I'm just here. I'm just here for the ride. This is amazing. あの特にあのこの方から始めてくださいというわけではなく、どのどなたでも結構ですのでお始めいただきましてよろしくお願いいたします。じゃあ僕からグランブ。まああの先ほど申し上げましたけど、まあガンダムダブル O 以降の作品って自分で作ってたんで非常に、えー、まあどれも好きでも好きなんですけど、やっぱり僕は世代的にファーストガンダムで育った。世代ですのでやっぱりファーストガンダムのシーンが一番思い浮かべられるんですけれども、えー、やっぱりあのラストシーンですね「あの巡り合い空」という映画で最後アムロが帰ってくるシーンやっぱあそこが一番、えー、思い出に残っているというか子どもの時にすごい感動したのをよく覚えています。So, I've been in charge of production of Gundam series after Double O, but when it comes down to it, the Gundam I grew up on, when it when I first watched when I was eight years old, was the first Gundam series. And of all the things that happened in that series, one that keeps coming back to me is the last scene in the third movie where Amro returns to everybody. I still feel moved by that scene and will forever remain the most memorable scene for me in Gundam. えっと、自分のやらせていただいたキャラクターの開始で関連のシーンになりますけれどもそのシーンに絞ればあ女スパイ潜入見張るラトケとのエピソードがあの印象に残っています。Well, for me, uh, I limit it to,、uh, to the scenes where、uh, my character Kai Shiden shows up and for me that would be、uh, the spy girl m i h a r u Uh, the, 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 the episode where、uh, Miharu and Kai meet, and then,、uh, well, and then、uh, Kai loses Miharu. That's, that's my best、uh, part in Gundam. Shia's <laughs> Nabu is a couple of steps out of the world. This is a couple <laughs> Shah Osnabal is the man who has left his past behind him. I look forward to his next role. <laughs> の後半の方なのでその一番最後の,あの戦いのところで、えー、といつも思ってたんですけれどもうんとアムロとシャアと皆さんがいつもどっちが好きですかって<笑>言われることがあって、えー、そりゃ若い方がいいじゃないなんていつも。<笑>あの最近はそう答えてるんですけれどもあの時はやっぱり本当にあの年上が好きだったんで<笑>あの時はああシャーターさんと思ったんですがあのいつも思うのはあの宇宙のロミオとジュリエットであの日本の極道の妻を演じたような気がして、えー、そこが大好きです。Uh, being a La La Soon, I only appear in one third of、uh, the first Gundam, the latter part.、Uh, my favorite scene is those、uh, battles at the very last、uh, with the Amuro and Shah. 
And uh, usually uh, this kind of panel, like many people ask me, like, which do you like, Amro or Shah? And um, um, personally, uh, recently, uh, uh, when I get this kind of question, I always say, like, well, definitely I like the younger one. But <laughs> when I was playing that role, um, I like the older gentleman better, so I said Shah at that time. <laughs> playing this role, I feel like um, uh, doing the Romeo and Juliet in the space, uh, playing like a, a wife of Gokudo, um, that's a uh, Yakuza in Japan. <laughs> uh, I feel like I'm, I'm kind of acting as a wife of Gokudo. Amuro is a boy who lives in the past. So Amuro loves First Gundam. Tokuni and Amro especially loves the part in the final battle in uh, the first Gundam at, in the battle of Abawaku where uh, Amro uses his uh, telepathy to get in touch with all the scattered crew of the white base. Amro very much values his friends. He's a very good guy. <laughs> Um, this question is primarily for the voice actors, but I was wondering, when this started 35 years ago, did you have any inkling that it would be where you are now, that you know, it would be this huge phenomenon? Hey. 次の質問は、声優の皆様方にお聞きしたいのですが、ガンダムが始まった35年前になりますが、35年前当時ガンダムがここまで人気が出るとは思いましたか？えっと途中で打ち切りになったんですね。1年経つ前ですから、ま視聴率があまり良くなかったのかなと思って、ここまでま2名会